Hi, this is Doc with HackingJungle.com, and today I'm going to give you guys a sneak peek of uh, homebrew on a 360. Um, here's the printer port that we use to solder. I use the landline uh, schematics that I saw online. Obviously, you can see my um, soldering skills are like nil to none. On a scale of 1 to 10, I give myself a negative 10. So I think anybody with enough persistence <coughs> will be able to do this as long as they get the uh, an Xbox with the right kernel. I uh, wanted to do it so bad, I ended up pulling a red ringer from a customer and trading them out for a newer console um, because it had the older dashboard on it. Um, I reflowed it. Um, basically, uh, hopefully it'll last for me. I'm going to do it on a console that's not a red ringer. First, I'm going to boot it up into Linux to give you guys a quick look at... Uh, See, there's the free 60 program. Um, now I'm going to turn it off and I'm going to boot it into the regular dashboard. Um, we did about 11 dumps. Every single one of them, uh, not one of them, matched. Um, so basically, uh, some of them were 40,000 blocks different. But um, we uh, went ahead and we found three that were the closest. We were like four and five blocks off. And we used a program that's going to be on the hacking jungle. Um, that fixed uh, went through and found matches and put up a good uh, NAND bin for us. And uh, the first time we flashed it, it came back as um, E79. So I pretty much figured we had a, a bad dump and all was lost. <coughs> we went ahead and flashed it again, turned it off, waited five minutes before we hooked it up. And you see, I just unlocked an achievement um, for turning on homebrew unlocked go to the ROM section. I had some trouble putting them on the hard drive so um, I just got them right now until I figure it out. I got a USB drive in the back with uh, all my games. Obviously I own all originals to these. These are just copies. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of games on there. Um, this is the menu for the Super Nintendo loader. Here's uh, we'll go ahead and put uh, maybe Super Mario All-Stars. Um, yet Mario Brothers on another console. Um, Let's go to the original Mario Brothers. Some people were having trouble with this uh, crashing. I had absolutely no uh, problems at all with it crashing. So uh, I got about five hours probably uh, so far into this and everything runs just absolutely flawless. So um, I'm shooting this with one hand. So obviously I'm not going to be able to do much. Let me give you guys a quick look at XEX Loader. I don't have any programs uh, really loading into it. I was working with the MAME a little bit, but I pretty much, uh, after doing this for a few days, I just uh, really wanted to take a break. Um, it's pretty cool the achievements get unlocked. Uh, basically, you'd be an idiot to take this online. Um, <coughs> at least till we can do the Kai link, where uh, basically uh, we'll just be able to get on a private server, so if you have a modified 360, uh, you know, your drives flash to play your backup games, you'll be able to uh, get on there and you won't have to worry about Microsoft uh, banning you. So there's basically uh, there's the uh, 360 with homebrew on a hardware perspective. It's going to be pretty badass just because of the graphic processors for this 360 are uh, phenomenal. So it's going to be pretty wild to see what's to come. Um, as you can see some of the achievements that I unlocked. There's uh, the first one I unlocked for the Super Nintendo. Um, it's uh, it's going to be a great year. Check it out. Hackingjungle.com. You need any support. Uh, we got some of the great, greatest staff as far as uh, help and support and as far as flashing or pretty much anything. I mean, the guys on the site are some of the best. Um, probably see more consoles and, and have troubleshooted more problems than, than pretty much anybody. So check it out. Um, uh, have fun and get on there. Start, you know, create your own pro programs. Make your own programs, experiment, and uh, let's see. Let's see the limits we can push this sucker to.